your results last night better than the street had been expecting. Earnings of a dollar thirty-one versus the one twenty-four the street was anticipating. What's, what's happening here? Because revenue was better than expected too. Akamai is continuing to perform very well, and just like to do a shout out to our eight thousand employees around the world who've been working so hard to keep the internet working really well at a time when billions of people need it to. Uh, we're seeing, you know, very strong traffic levels across the board. Of course, that's not surprising because so many people are using the internet now. I think what's more surprising is there's been an enormous increase in attack traffic. Uh, you know, I think the threat actors are trying to take advantage of the pandemic. And of course, the prize is greater now that so much business has moved online, but just quarter over quarter seeing doublings of the malicious traffic. Doublings of malicious traffic, of people trying to break into to some of these corporate networks, is that just because they see an opportunity with people working at home, they think it's an easier target? It is an easier target because just as you point out, people are working remotely, it's a little bit less secure. Uh, I think a lot of enterprises still haven't totally caught up with the security. Uh, the prize is greater because so much business is online now. Uh, just in the last couple of months, we've seen an enormous increase in these uh, extortion DDoS attacks. Literally dozens of major enterprises, mostly financial institutions, national stock markets being uh, threatened uh, you know, with massive DDoS attacks if they don't pay up. Uh, and this is an area where we've really been able to help uh, our customers and now new customers. DDoS, denial of service attacks. How are you guys keeping up with the bad guys if they are working at a much more frenetic pace. I assume you've got your people working at home too. Absolutely, we have over 95% of our employees working remotely. We, we did that very early on in the pandemic and you know that's worked out very well. We've been very, very pleased about that. Uh, you know, and in terms of security, we make enormous investments and have for a long time to be able to stay ahead with the various kinds of attacks out there, you know, denial of service, uh, application layer attacks where someone's trying to corrupt the content on a website. Uh, you've got attacks on enterprises where you're embedding malware into employees' devices, and then you can try to cause a data breach. You know, even reputable websites now are getting hacked with mage card attacks because they reference third party sites, and those sites are compromised. And then, you know, anybody who goes to the site uh, gets hacked. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.